I am sad, I'm angry, I'm frustrated. Tonight at 10, a Milwaukee nonprofit targeted two nights in a row. A thief breaking in, stealing expensive equipment and items used to uplift our community. Marisha and Elizabeth with the Dominican Center showed our Mike Beermeister the damage left behind. Uh, they uh, broke the door uh, on the second night. Uh, they broke the door again and the window. It's still difficult for Elizabeth Perdomo to understand why a burglar would ransack the nonprofit Dominican Center on back to back nights. It was very frustrating and scary at the same time. Each year, the center near 24th and Locust serves around 3,000 people in the Amani neighborhood with after school activities for kids and programs for adults. Some virtual for those who can't access the space. The burglar left a trail of destruction both early Thursday and Friday morning, stealing over $12,000 worth of tablets, laptops, smart TVs, diapers, even snacks for kids. He actually drank juices, sodas, left everything on the floor. Security video shows the burglar leaving the front of the building on foot with one of the TVs early Thursday morning. Sure, so we've got the wood here and the four by four in the inside and the outside. Perdomo believes the thief used this hammer to get in both nights. It wasn't just technology or snacks taken. The burglar also stole decades worth of photos and memories that was in a memory card on this desk. It comes as the center prepares to celebrate 30 years of service to the community. Dominican Center Executive Director Marisha Harris tells me this burglar also took 30 new Halloween costumes for kids that were going to be given out at next Saturday's Harvest Festival that the center puts on. It doesn't just impact us who are in this building, but it impacts all of those that we serve. In Milwaukee, Mike Biermeister, TMJ4 News. So if you would like to help the Dominican Center, we will have the information on how you can donate in Mike's story at TMJ4.com.